Hello and welcome back to another Python tutorial. My name's Tom with Mastercode Online. And as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Uh, we're going to still be working on the generated functions, but I did have a question from a follower named John. He wanted to know, is there a way to avoid this stop iteration exception? Yes, there is. I'm going to show you that right now. So let's take a look. Let's create a list. A is equal to... Uh, one, two, three, four, and five. All right, there's our list. Now we're going to create a function. So we'll say define value. We'll pass in um, x. All right, and we'll say for i in x, we're going to go ahead and yield i. There we go. All right, so here we go. How are we going to handle the stop iteration uh, issue? Uh, I guess the best way to do it would be create a function. So let's create a function, define, and we'll call, we'll just call it error for now. All right. And I'm going to pass in a iteratable is I, and we're going to come down and say try. We're going to use a try statement. If you guys are not familiar with try statement, what it's going to do is going to try to run a code. If it gets a, any type of exception or error return to it, it's going to go into the accept clause. The accept clause will explain to Python how we want to handle it and I'll show you that in a second so let's go ahead and do uh, val is equal to next I like that and then we're gonna print val all right and then we're gonna say accept and we're gonna say what exception we want to handle and we're gonna say stop iteration just like this and we're gonna go ahead and do something let's just print uh, it's done all right and that should be it now how do we handle these two together well first we're gonna go ahead and say B is equal to value of X uh, not X because X is not a value so we'll say B is equal to value of a and pass that in and then we're going to say error all right b hit return we get one so what's happening first off we're calling our function and passing in an argument of a which contains a list of one two three four and five all right so b is now representing that now we call b on error uh could have probably named that a little bit better for you guys but uh i was thinking of how to handle an error so we're passing in B now B is now representing an iteratable so if I call B we get the generator object which is an iterator object all right so we're passing that through we're going to try to um, handle uh, call the next function on it so we're trying to call that if it works we're going to get a value passed to the val um, uh, variable and then we're going to print val if it does not work we're going to get accept stop iteration print done all right so let's go ahead and take a look at that all the way down through and since i'm only at the bottom of my screen i'm going to clear what we got so far and we're just going to do rb 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 and done all right so that's how we avoid the stop iteration um exception now you could have put like passed or something in there that would return nothing in the program would have just continued on all right so that's how you handle it if you have any questions please let me know i'm here to help you guys out otherwise forget to don't forget to <laughs> like subscribe and share our videos see you in the next one